a primordial world of light and shadow. A submerged continent of reef and fish, of coral mountains and valleys of the deep. Seventy million years ago, in the tectonic upheaval of the Earth, the continents drifted and the ocean floor was reformed. Here, a remnant of the primordial seas between Asia and Australia evolved and spawned the growth of the reefs around the equator. The richest coral in the world is right here, somewhere between Papua New Guinea and all the way to the Malay Peninsula. Is the richest coral growth on our planet. Coral lives in a kind of a wide band, like a belt around the earth, a warm water belt. Here is the Eden, the very center, right here. The heart of the Earth's coral zone, genesis of the reefs, strange and beautiful, fecund and prolific, surging with a force of life and nature, at once powerful, fragile, vast and finite. These are the deeps of Asia. Journey with David Dublay to a land at once beautiful and desolate, forged of volcanic fire and coral limestone. The edge of a great oceanic frontier that David calls the Seventh Continent. We are at the edge of the Seventh Continent. It is an extra continent in this world. Some of it's submerged, some of it's made mountains, some of it's made kingdoms, some of it's made, made countries. Coral. What I've seen in our short journey are problems. Hunger hangs on the fringe of the richest reefs in the world the paradox of Eden. When you see a reef system where most of the fish are gone, it means that the people above in the canoe, looking down at the reef through goggles, fishing the reef, are desperate. They're in desperate need of protein. Kala created the light and covered Mother Earth with a mantle of water. So the text of the Jato Yoga records the beginnings of the Balinese cosmos. Bali, last Asiatic outpost to the east, gateway to the biogeographical zone of transition between Asia and Australia, bastion of ancient empire by the sea.
The Deeps of Asia, compelling, poignant, the story of the fate of the seas of Asia and the destiny of its people.